Welcome to day 926 in my Hex and Pulse Chain journey, I hope you're doing all great. Thanks for my latest subscriber Ibra, welcome to the hood brother. And now please make sure to smash that like button, let's get this video up to 500 likes, hit that subscriber button and turn on post notification to get notified for every new video. And now let's get started with today's episode. I know it has been a while since my latest video was uploaded, but I was quite busy building stuff, working in the legacy world and just earning some dirty fiat. And if you have a look at the chart you could almost cry at least there are a lot of cry babies on twitter at the moment so just keep it positive and if you're interested in some sweet sweet yield all you have to do is use hex because hex is a decentralized smart contract which is audited three time and works just flawless 100 uptime on the ethereum blockchain so if you want to have some cheap hex opportunity and if you have a look at the recent chart maybe this video is for you i'm going to show you today how to set limit orders on much xyz and other platforms but first let's have a quick look at the chart most of you guys are familiar with the chart it doesn't look so bad if you look at the historical chart overall if we can see the dips the recent dips in the history we have a lot of dips in the past this current dip is probably the longest and the hardest we have so far. We had down here quite some hard dips as well around the big payday, but now we're dipping like everything else in the crypto space around 94%. And maybe the dip is not over yet. As you can see here on the weekly chart, if we switch over to the daily chart, you can see these massive wicks in here. The wicks down to the downside, also sometimes to the upside, but recently more to the downside. And if you would like to have a cheap entry down below here in these wicks you could set limit orders and you will sleep peacefully because you don't have to watch actually the minute chart and press market order for this your limit order is set gets filled and all good if we switch quickly back to the weekly chart people normally just measure the dips which is quite a heavy dip with 94 percent but maybe sometimes you should also just measure how much we went up until now you can see it already here 55 thousand percent which is quite massive compared to a little dip of 94%. Of course, it always matters where you enter, but let's assume just you, we're gonna wick even further down to, let's say just two cents or even further down to one cents. And maybe you would like to have a sweet, sweet limit order set right there just to catch some nice cheap hex down there. All you have to do is head over to Matcha XYZ, Matcha like the fruit. So this is a trusted platform where you can connect your wallet and do some some decent limit order trading. So first, when you visit the site, you have to connect your MetaMask wallet. For that, click on the upper right side here, connect wallet, then choose your preferred wallet. In this case, we're gonna go with MetaMask. I'm gonna choose MetaMask, click next to connect the website to my MetaMask account, and voila, I'm already connected. And in the second step, you click the search bar on the top left, you search for your desired token. In this case, we're gonna search the Hex token running on the Ethereum blockchain for now, soon on the Pulse chain and you see a familiar web interface where you can set the market orders basically just click the button and buy the amount of hex you would like or for the second option you have here the limit order on the left side you have the chart you can see the 24 hour chart the weekly chart and the monthly chart overall we're trending heavily down at the moment which is always a good opportunity to buy some dips and with this tool you should be even able to catch some lower dips as well first let me quickly explain what you can do here this is the usual interface for a market order so for example i would like to spend some usdc tokens for hex at the moment i would receive for 100 dollars 3082 hex tokens this would be the fastest way to acquire some hex and of course we have the limit order menu in here and you have some settings over here if you click the settings you can change the slippage if you would like so you can change the exchanges where it should route through and you can adjust the gas price in fast very fast or custom if you would like to get your trade through pretty quickly i leave that as a default for now keep in mind the gui fees are actually quite high normally a sunday or a saturday is better but i just wanted to talk quickly about the advanced settings anyway gonna click this menu away and choose now limit order this is what we're gonna do for now if we switch back to the 24 hour chart we can see the current price for one hex is 0 0.032576 usdc so on the limit tab it's actually quite easy to fill out the limit order first you're gonna set the price you would like to pay for your hex in this case it just takes the current price so but we would like to pay maybe 
maybe a cheaper price. So let's just assume hex is going to dip lower. Let's take two cents for now. And we would like to spend 100 USDC. That would give me 5,000 hex tokens once the price goes down and my order would get filled. You have another option in here. You can set how long this limit order should be there. 10 minutes, one hour, 24 hours, three days or seven days. For now, let's go with three days. And another important information, you can set limit orders, in my opinion, only with USDC and Erupt Ethereum you can't set limit orders with Ethereum. So keep in mind, use USDC or wrapped Ethereum if you would like to set a limit order. And of course, you need some Ethereum in your wallet to pay the fees. About the fees, this is pretty sexy as well. If you use a limit order this way, you only have to sign a statement to set the limit order. So we're going to do this right away. We're going to review the limit orders. We need first to give some permission to spend the USDC. This will cost me a little bit of transaction fee, $4.90. 91. Let's confirm this first. After the spending of the USDC is approved, I will just sign a message to set this limit order. So this is basically still free. And once the price drops, my order gets filled, I will only have to pay the fee to get my hex tokens into my wallet. So we're going to see this right away. You can see the rate again, one hex for two cents should give me for $100, 5,000 hex tokens, estimated fee, zero dollar. All you have to do is now click the button place limit order. MetaMask opens up again and you can already see all I have to do is to sign a statement. And if I can go all to the button, I can also sign it now. And it's just getting signed and my limit order should appear soon down here in the list. And now you can see limit order placed success and I can set also a new limit order, for example, at 2.5 cents or whatever I would like to have. And I see now down here on the left open orders, 5000 hex I shall receive by selling 100 USDC. This would be a price for 50 hex per USDC or you can see 2 cents per hex. You see also status of 0%. It's not filled yet, of course, because the price needs to come down first. But once it's coming down there, the order will get filled and the hex will get magically transferred to your wallet. Until now, we didn't spend so much money to set some limit orders. If you would like to cancel a limit order, you can click here the little cross and MetaMask opens up again. This time you have to pay some Ethereum fees, in this case around $4, or you just wait until the order is expired after three or seven days or how long you set the limit orders in the beginning. The second platform is the one inch exchange. You can do the same here. The interface looks familiar. In the first row, you have the swap interface where you just basically do a market swap. And in the second second interface, you click limit. It's basically the same example in here. I would like to spend 100 USDC for a price of 50 hex per USDC. I can set again the expiring limit of this limit order. We have 10 minutes, one hour, one day, three days, seven days, 30 days, and three months, six months, one year, two years, and even three years and custom. So you can do whatever you want. You just choose the days, the limit you like, and then you scroll down, you see review limit order again. And before you can do that, you have to sign a statement that you're not a citizen of America. So in this case, nothing bad happens. If you sign and proceed, MetaMask will open up and you will sign a weird statement again. I'm going to hit cancel and hop over back to Matcha XYZ. The user interface is user friendly and you have all your open orders down here. So I will let run this limit order until it expires and maybe or hopefully it will get filled and I will get some cheap, cheap hex, which I can then stake again and add to my staking ladder. And with that, we are already by the end of this video for today. If you found any value, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel and drop a comment down below. And as always, stake long and fat, stay safe out there and see you in the next one. Peace.